Hi guys, my name is Amanda Gaston and welcome to the Likewise tutorial that is sponsored by South Island Public Library. Um, so today we're gonna talk about Likewise, as I said, which is novelist and Goodreads combined. So it gives you movie book, um, podcast and TV show recommendations, as well as like an open forum concept where you know you can talk to other people that have the same interests in book genres, TV show genres as yourself. So um, I've set up my account kind of sorta, of, but we're gonna I'm gonna go with you step by step so that you guys can kind of see how cool it is. Um, I've been using it for the last couple of months and I think it's amazing. And I found a lot of good TV show recommendations. I haven't been reading as much guys because of work and everything, but once I get back into my reading, I will definitely be using likewise for that as well. So I'm gonna share my screen with you guys. Uh, so, like I said, it's called Likewise, and you can just Google search the name of it. You don't have to put in, like, any specific code or any specific, like, URL. And once you get to, like, the, when you Google it, it's the first, it's the first search. Um, but this is kind of what it looks like. It is an app, and it, they prefer you to use Likewise on your phone, but you can use it on the computers as well. Um, and this is kind of what the the app will look like, the basic concept, um, where you can swipe left, swipe right. So it's like Tinder and um, Hinge or whatever the one that people like uh, for books and podcasts. So I'm gonna sign in, but I'm gonna pause the screen, but this is kind of what it looks like. I'm gonna be quiet for a second, guys, because I have to remember my password. It's really hard to type in things. Okay, so this is kind of what it'll look like if you haven't added anything and personalized it. And personalizing your page will give you better recommendations for books that you personally like. So um, once you've joined, you can always say, if you don't want to personalize right away, you want to wait, you can always say, no thanks, maybe later. Um, and, but when it's an app, they kind of, kind of forces you to do it versus on the computer, which you get the option of saying, not now. Um, but I'm going to personalize mine. It gives you the username. Uh, I have a second account for my personal use. Uh, but this is just the one I wanted to show you guys, like how everything works. So as I said, you get movies and TV, books and podcasts. We're going to actually go with books because, um, I think it's better that way. Um, and then you you pick at least five that you've read and that you've liked. And the more you add, the more kind of is able to hone and personalize your, your page for you. Um, so we're gonna click. I'm gonna do Harry Potter because we can always just say I read five Harry Potter books because I did. Oh. No, I'll do them one by one. Well, no, we'll do that by and I haven't read the help, but at this point, I just want to kind of show you guys. Um, I just don't want to lie and say I've read something that I haven't. Okay, um, so there's five for us, book wise. And usually, if they want you to kind of like at least 60 books um, so that they're able to go kind of hone it more. And then once you've kind of gotten everything that you liked, this is kind of what you'll see. So they'll give you best book recommendations, best indoor book guides, and each one kind of comes with a list of books that they think you may like. Um, and then this is all in the discovery tab. You, it's the same for movies, um, the same for podcasts. I don't listen to as many podcasts when so my podcast is still kind of low. Um, and then it's people. So you can follow specific likewisers who kind of align with you. Um, following, it gives you a list of your followings. It's like social media, but for book lovers. Um, Ask is where it's really cool because these are forums where you can go, I am looking for a book similar to um, Mariana Zapata's Slow Burnt Books. And I want a list of all of those. Um, 
and then it's open for however long you want it to be open. And uh, some people may respond, some may not. And as you can see, like I'm looking for a TV show or a movie like Timeless, The Librarians of Warehouse 13. Um, in this, you can see the ask, and then you get the right to vote or you can add recommendations. So I like most of these recommendations. So when you add the little plus sign, you kind of are adding your agreement to it. And you're more or less bringing it up. So you, if you click on one that you like, it brings the rating up one. If you don't, everything else kind of gets, it gets dropped. Um, I don't have any additional recommendations, so I wouldn't add anything here. Um, but it kind of goes like that for books, TV, movies, podcasts, that type of thing. Um, and then you have a blog where you can kind of read people's re reviews of everything. So um, 27 scariest movies of all time, what's streaming this week? So it's very, very cool. And um, that's all on their end of your response and you, you're playing, but you can add a post where you can do a list of showcasing your favorite things. You can do recommendations of your own um, and then ask, so you can ask the community. Uh, they also do within, let's go back to this. Um, they actually genres as well, which kind of didn't pop up here. But within the genre, you get put into little clubs. So uh, if you like um, all sci-fi, you guys are put into a sci-fi club and you're able to ask everyone within your club what they like best. So it, it very much hones to who you are specifically and personally. Um, you can tune more books you from your feed. You can add movies as well. Um, we'll do story, we'll do that. Avengers, let's see, what else? I don't wanna lie and tell you guys I like something that I don't and then people are like, oh, we, we saw you like that. No. <laughs> I want to be very honest with these and I like to be very honest uh you have to like at least 11 um some of these are on my list of things to watch still guys so please don't judge me um I'm with mother I'm very much a big comedy head I lied about the Outlanders Dexter of house mm. Coco look amazing. Okay, so I have enough to kind of like hone it a little bit more. <laughs> and then it'll tell you like 23 out of 25, and then you can add more to the feed. That way they're really learning you. Uh, sometimes it takes a little while, but you can always go back. As long as you haven't reached the maximum of how much it takes to hone your feed, every, it'll let you go back in and click more. And if you go over while you're honing your feed, there is no problem. Um, and then they'll give you picks for you. And because you like something else, they'll, they'll go, okay, so you saw this. And you can always save. If you haven't seen it, you can save, which means that, you know, it's, it gives you the extra information in your own personal account or in your saves to let you know, okay, so this is where you can find it, as you can see. Um, and it tells you tips from other people, the movies that are similar. Uh, see, but I've seen this, so I don't want to save it. And you can always unclick it. You don't have to. So when you click the little horn that looks like you're sounding it out, it's your recommendation, but you don't have to write anything. Sharing the actual post is, is optional. So you just kind of are letting yourself and everyone else know. I've read, th I've read this, I've watched this, I love this. Um, you don't have to recommend this to me because it, it's my jam. And then as you continue to say, okay, I've seen this, I like this, it adds to your movie recommendation and tunes to your feed. Um, same things with books, podcasts, we, it's the same exact thing. Um, all right, guys. So specific ones like I'll watch uh, or listen to technically. Uh, 
I'm getting better. I've only listened to like three podcasts at all. I'm working on it, guys. Um, and with Dolly Parton and Detective Trap. And for there, it's the same thing. So society and culture, it gives you recommendations based on your society and culture picks. So based on whatever picks you have, it gives you recommendations for that. Same with everything else. Um, you can view your own profile and see your activity and see what recommendations you have. So anything you've liked is basically your recommendation. Um, they have a list you haven't added anything or recommended anything so you don't have a list as of yet um you need to complete your profile which means you have to like add a bio upload a picture add a zip code if you want i don't personally have one uh it also has your ask so if you answer anyone's questions or you post your own questions those count as well um and then you follow people and it's very much a very cool way to kind of like get to know people that are very similar to you without having to leave your house in a pandemic and um also people are able to say if you love this please watch that it'll blow your mind and it gives you something else to talk about and something else to look at and something else to do um you have an inbox but i personally never use it because i don't get notifications either um your settings, you can change your passwords, you can delete your account here. Um, but I'm gonna stop sharing because that's that. Um, and so that's likewise the very, very general broad range of it. I hope you guys love it. If you have any questions, do not hesitate to call the South Holland Library and ask for me or any other library assistant. So you guys have a nice one. Thank you.